Mary scarcely appeared in the first coming of Christ, but in the second coming of Jesus Christ, Mary must be known and openly revealed by the Holy Spirit so that Jesus may be known, loved, and served through her. Towards the end of the world, Almighty God and His Holy Mother are to raise up saints who will surpass in holiness most of the saints. These great souls filled with grace and zeal will be chosen to oppose the enemies of God who are raging on all sides. They will be exceptionally devoted to the Blessed Virgin, illumined by her light, strengthened by her spirit, supported by her arms, sheltered under her protection. They will fight overthrowing and crushing heretics and their heresies, schismatics and their schisms, idolaters and their idolatries, sinners and their wickedness. They will be true apostles of the latter times. They will have the silver wings of the dove enabling them to go wherever the Holy Spirit calls them. They will have the two-edged sword of the Word of God in their mouths and the blood-stained standard of the cross on their shoulders. They will carry the crucifix in their right hand and the rosary in their left and the holy names of Jesus and Mary on their hearts.